Travel across America with me. We are in downtown Birmingham. We've gone to the peanut place and the heaviest corner on earth. And now I want to take you to two really unusual places. The first was the Robert S. Vance Federal Building and U.S. Courthouse. We had done some preliminary research on where to go and what to see in downtown Birmingham and came across a 14-step walking tour, and that's where I got some of these ideas. And one of them was to go to 1800 Fifth Avenue North, where you'll see the striking white marble building that sprawls the entire city block. It was built in 1921 as the United States District Court for the Northern District of Alabama and as a United States Postal Service location. It now serves as the Robert S. Vance Federal Building and U.S. Courthouse. It is an amazing Corinthian-style structure. And as we were walking the block around this building, something caught my eye that seemed more interesting than this big building. It was the Birmingham branch of the Federal Reserve Bank of Atlanta. Isn't it gorgeous? It looks like a little miniature of something, not sure what. We started walking around it and taking pictures and I read this sign. Built to house the Birmingham branch of the Federal Reserve Bank of Atlanta. The historic Federal Reserve Building was completed in 1927 out of poured concrete and white Stone Mountain, Georgia granite. Have you ever been to Stone Mountain? I have. Tell me in the comments below if you have been to Stone Mountain. The building is in a style known as Greco Deco, a combination of Greek classicism and Art Deco elements. In 1958, a five-story addition with two sub-basements was added to the east wall of the building to serve the growing needs of the Federal Reserve. The Federal Reserve occupied the space for over 70 years until the branch moved to Liberty Park. In 2014, the building was bought by two investment firms and they embarked on an extensive historic rehabilitation venture, bringing the bank back to its 1920s aesthetic roots. Have you subscribed? If not, please subscribe, and if you have, Thank you. Once again, a prominent structure in the financial district, the historic Federal Reserve stands as a physical reminder of Birmingham's booming past and bright future. We were walking around and I thought, you know what, I'm going to try the door. And we opened the door and we walked in and it is the most beautiful building. We talked to the young lady at the counter and she said, oh, you can go in anywhere and walk around and don't forget to go see the vault that is the restrooms. I was like, you've got to be kidding. Okay. So I said, well, can we go in there? And she said, sure. So we walked through these glass doors to see this large vault. Isn't this just simply incredible? The lobby is, I don't know how else to say it, but spick and span. It's gorgeous. And we thought, you know what? We will take this opportunity to go to the restroom and see what she is talking about. We walked down the hall and saw these great paintings and photographs. And there it was, the restroom. Isn't this hysterical? Yep, it's the restroom. more old time photographs of downtown Birmingham. So if you need to go, you can always go to the Federal Reserve Vault restroom. Be sure to watch the videos on the American Peanut Company and the world's heaviest corner. And where will we be going next in Birmingham? Well, it's a surprise. Don't you like surprises? Sandals on the ground. Unclassic road trip.